Well, you've made a fine choice on a web show that you chose to click on tonight. You've done up the bros of the brew once again. You know, we talk about anything and everything, so we invite you to have a beer and join us online live for our chat and chime in with this one. Jersey Joe here, of course, Joel over there in the box. And you know what? This year is definitely moving fast. It's, it seems like before, any time I turn around, it's already like Christmas season again. You know, there's a year that's definitely flying by. So you want to know what do you think is the best season or best time of the year? We've got a lot of good comments. We've got a great poll coming up here in a little bit, too. So we're going to get to that. Joe, I'm going to go to you. What do you think is the best time or season of the year? Fall. Fall? Um, yeah. When I was a kid, I, I still thought fall when I was a kid, but for different reasons because I liked the cold. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was always fun to get into, like, snowball fights and shit. And winter, winter, too. Um, there was one point where I had a go-kart. And I would drive it down the street when it was snowing out, mm -hmm. and I would uh, cut at the last minute and and just go like do a donut. Um, <laughs> so those those were the best like uh, fireplace having like watching football or baseball sitting by the fireplace while it's cold outside, Snuggling. having like warm soup <laughs> is just like a really really amazing feeling, especially if you ever get to do it in a log cabin. Hmm. Um, That's a new one. So those ones those ones are cool. Summer was always too hot for me, and mm -hmm. spring was always kind of, I had allergies, so that one bothered me too. <laughs> but um, I would say ever since I moved to Vegas as an adult, mm -hmm. um, I like, actually I like fall the best here because it's warm. Like it's 80 out right now. It's nice. Like I don't have to put on heat, I don't have to put on air conditioning for like three months, and yeah. then there's a three month period in the spring like that too, so definitely fall. Well, for me, I'm going to say fall also because, first off, I hate heat. The summer is kind of nice and you can travel, but I hate, like, just sweating. There's nothing you can do when you're sweating except run into air conditioning. But if you're outside at a ballpark or outside doing things, there's no escape unless you jump into a pool or something. So there's no way out of that, at least in the fall. You know, it's not too bad. Here in New York City, you know, it's about 60 degrees, you know, although it's been a little bit warmer this year. So you can kind of put a hoodie on or long sleeves and deal with it. You know, when you're cold, you can get warm. When it's hot, unless you go to air conditioning, you can't get cold. So I hate winter driving, too. Growing up in the country, I am done. I'm so glad I live in a city now where I don't have to shovel all that snow for hours and hours and hours. It'd ruin your whole day. And it's just not fun, especially then you'd plow the driveway, all of a sudden have the township or the state come back and plow the damn thing shut. It happened all the time. And then I'm getting yelled at, yeah, I gotta shovel the car out. I just did. So there's no win with that. Spring, okay, spring I do like it a little bit because it's start of baseball season, so that's a little bit fun. But, you know, I don't have allergies, but it's just still the things are kind of dead, and it's still kind of cold until Memorial Day. So fall for me, but my second part of that is I am going to say Christmas time in New York City is absolutely magical. The city looks spectacular with all the lights up and the displays. So technically, I'm going to say the Christmas season as well, which is why I was interested asking earlier, what season do you think? Because New York really looks great at Christmas, and it's a lot of fun, and it's also packed with tourists. we got to get you here one time during the Christmas season to see what New York's like, because it's it's something special. For shizzle. <laughs> For shizzle. I've been to Vegas before during Christmas, and it's interesting because some casinos do have decorations up, then others have nothing at all. Fremont Street downtown, they get a big tree up, the whole like canopy you know, there in Vegas, it plays Christmas music and everything. But eh, some places, you wouldn't know what holiday of the year it is, so... Christmas in Vegas, so it can be a lot of fun, and also there's not many tourists there either. That's definitely your, that's definitely your slow yeah, season. Yeah, thing. I, I'm not really down with snow anymore. No, me so neither. as an adult, I'm not. Winter is only the bottom part of the country for me. Yeah. Uh, forever. Yeah. And summer will only be the top part of the country for me forever. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Although I think you and I could really destroy some people in a snowball fight. That would be, that's a good activity we should put on the list. And then also I love how you have the picture, how you can like move your car backwards and forwards so you can make like these little hearts with your tire tracks. That's pretty spectacular. Yeah, I can do that in the snow. I'm not going to ever do it again because I'm never going north when it snows anymore. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I can do that. There's picture, there's picture evidence on my Instagram. <laughs> you can also, why don't you just work at it in the sand there in Vegas? You have a desert right there. You should be able to do it. I'll just drive off the curb. You'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think I'm going to be doing that. Let's take a couple of viewer comments right now because lots of you chimed in online. And uh, Bronx Bombers, she says, summer. And Richard Poole, he also says, summer. So you got two summers right there. All right, they didn't exactly agree with us. But I'll tell you what, Joel, let's just go straight what to What was the, the reasoning? <laughs> well, let's go straight. well, that's true. It depends what part of the country they're in, too, because maybe their summers aren't 120 degrees like yours. And summers here in New York City, man, it gets hot and humid here. The city just smells like hot piss. It just does. And it's... Yeah, it's garbage. It smells like garbage. Yeah. And it's the, the only thing that I hate about summer 
uh, like anywhere around a coast, including New York, is the humidity just kills me. Oh, yeah. I can't deal with it. Yeah. And it's, clearly it's you horrible. and I with the humidity have a really bad hair day. Never mind. Yeah. Very horrible, horrible <laughs> yeah, hair day. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look. I know. <laughs> All right, let's take, let's go to the poll because you know that's going to be the easiest way to solve the problem. As always, we leave it in your hands. So, what do you think is the best season of the year? Survey says fifty percent of you said autumn. Wait, you didn't agree with our live comments at all. Thirty-three percent of you said spring, and only seventeen percent said summer. And nobody, nobody likes winter. Well, just like Mr. Scrooge said, bah humbug on the winter. I think if you had more followers from Vegas, you would probably get more people that like winter. Just because it's kind of mild, you have to. <coughs> yeah. Don't get me wrong; it'll still be cold-ish, but it won't snow except in rare occasions. So most of the time, you're wearing like a sweatshirt and some uh, jeans. Like you would wear long jeans. Hey, I've been to Vegas when it snows before, and you guys completely panic. Yeah. I actually, it snowed when I was out there probably like eight years ago, and I was walking down the strip with a case of beer in bottles, stupidly by the way, and I stepped up on a curb, and it was slick, and whoop, down I went, and half the case of beer bottles went too, and it was, it was a sad Aww. occasion. I know. I know. Let's take our last viewer comment. And Dennis writes in and says, I prefer the season of the witch. When the darkness, the equinox, bring the spirit world in touch with mere mortal, mortals, fire and rain torches. Oh, what are we talking about? <laughs> what is this, Twilight? I think, yeah, I think we all, we know Dennis loves the women, but I think in this case, case he's liking the witches too as well. He's definitely talking about Halloween, I think. All right. <laughs> we want to thank you for our live viewers and John us up by the way and make sure you click the like and subscribe button and don't miss by the web show kickback jersey joe every thursday at noon on youtube all new episodes short episodes lots of fun we have it quick every thursday at noon eastern so join the fun there da, da, and also da, meet da. us oh, here shit, every week it. as well and joe your box went sideways but that's okay well thank you guys for dialing us up here today jersey joe ion in a rectangle over there and we'll see you next time i hope